morning and thank you for joining our daily outlook. And today we'll cover the changes in the euro dollar pair. Greg will be sharing insights from our trading desk. The euro-dollar pair corrected downwards in the last session, falling 0.2%. The stochastic indicator is giving a negative signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. The last session saw the dollar gain 0.6% against the yen. The ROC is giving a positive signal. The gold-dollar pair made a minor downwards correction in the last session, dropping 0.2%. The MACD's negative signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. Volkswagen shares made a minor downwards correction in the last session, falling 0.3%. The ROC is giving a negative signal. Thank you for sharing with us. Now let's hear from our news department. Sterling fell to a one-month low as investors pushed back expectations of a rate hike by the Bank of England after a flurry of weak data. Wall Street indexes bounced back from recent losses as concerns over a default by China's Evergrande eased while investors awaited policy cues from a Federal Reserve meeting later. Rishi Sunak has declared that Britain's economy is roaring back after firms returned £1.3 billion paid out under the Treasury's job furlough scheme. Thank you for this. Now coming up, today's major economic events. The French market manufacturing PMI will be released at 7.15 GMT, the U.S. market services PMI at 13.45 GMT, the U.S. Market Manufacturing PMI at 13.45 GMT. The U.K.'s Market Services PMI will be released at 8.30 GMT. The French Market Services PMI at 7.15 GMT. The U.K.'s Monetary Policy Summary at 1100 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to log in tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial market.